caught you on C-SPAN about a year ago talking about, I think it was the, if I can, I'll, I'm going to paraphrase your quote, the government is taking this seriously. They're starting to take, uh, to make it such that people who are advising retirees actually need to advise with their best interest at heart, right? This is the fiduciary role from, yes. uh, from, uh, from a while okay. ago. This, this, this is a, a basic challenge. It comes from the fact that people started thinking of retirement in one way and then the world changed and they have to catch up. Mm -hmm. So back in the days when employers were responsible for retirement plans, yes. you could say to employers, dear employer, you're a fiduciary, you got to take care of your employees, you got to act in their best interests, etc. But we're moving to a world in which the employers are saying, I may make a contribution, but it's your problem. So then the question is, in a world in which you don't have employers being knowledgeable and watching, who do you have? And the answer is you've got lots of financial advisors, you've got institutions, et cetera, that give advice, but you want to make sure that they don't have walking conflicts of interest, mm -hmm. that they, the people who rely on them don't have to worry about whether or not a recommendation is to is to fill my pocket rather than rather than someone else's. So that's what the Department of Labor was trying to was trying to do and has been trying has been trying to do. And it's not like it's the end of the need to Oh yeah, to do this. It's actually a beginning of the need to do this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and yeah, I mean yeah, even if it's passed, mm -hmm. uh, you know, and certainly, you know, there are plenty of investment professionals, you know, who I'm privileged to speak for at CFA New York and CFA Institute Globally who take who, thought this was a wonderful thing. Uh, the, our email inbox is lit up with all kinds of positive news. Uh, oh, there are plenty of people who already are doing it. Mm -hmm. Most people are already doing it. There are people who are in favor of it in principle, but are afraid that the government will, through clumsiness, mm -hmm. make life worse rather than it. And then there are people who say, I've got a really nice job selling to people. Why are you complicating my life? by providing consumer protections on that. And my view is, that's the group of people you wanna make sure leave the market. Yeah.